Hi there and welcome back to another week of projects and progress here at Youngsteads. We're glad to have you back and we've got some more exciting progress here to show you on the 66 Corvette project. Uh, it's been a long road. We've been at this project off and on for probably about a, just a close to a year now. And uh, you know, we got the car in from that Mecham auction down south, started out with a red coat of paint on it that just didn't look that good. Dry spray under the handles and uh, just overspraying the lights and door jams and everything. So we got the car completely torn down, all media blasted. Spent months doing fiberglass work on the car, then body work, finally, you know, getting the, the, the gaps and the seams and everything lined up just perfect. Uh, what we showed you last time in the last video was the gel coat. That gel coat goes over the bodywork and fiberglass to seal everything up really good. They then blocked it, sand that out. And now uh, we're to the final priming stage in the car. I'm gonna introduce you to Alberto, our painter, and he's gonna tell you a little bit about what's going on with the car. Alberto? Hi, my name is Alberto Casillas. I am the automotive refinishing extraordinaire here at Youngstead's Collision. Uh, here we have, we have the 66 Corvette that's ready for its second round and uh, final round of primer. About to spray about, say about a gallon and a half of primer on this thing, four to five coats. Get it all looking nice and gray, and we can start sanding it and getting it ready for final paint. Uh, average paint job is minimum about 100 hours. We're a little bit farther along on this, but we still have to do the inside, so I will have at least another 100 man hours into this before it's said and done and ready for reassembly. Uh, originally from Chicago, uh, painted out there ever since I got out of high school. I've been doing this for about 15 years now. I've done everything from collision work, restoration work, custom paint work, airbrushing. I've taught, I've done tech rep work. I actually was uh, teaching custom paint and airbrushing at Lincoln Technical College for a while. So I've done many restorations, never done a Corvette. So this will be my first Corvette, which makes it kind of exciting. Um, the paint sticks to it, I painted it. Painted guitars, boats, snowboards, airplanes, lots of cars, lots of motorcycles. Um, certified in almost every paint system there is. <laughs> We're now uh, spraying water-based paint, so I'm assuming we'll probably be spraying this car in water-based. It's gonna look fantastic. Shiny and red, I think, is the goal we're going for. Very slick, very flat, a lot like a marble. Thanks, Alberto. Exciting progress. I'm sure your uh, arms will be a little sore after all that sanding. Thank you for your hard work on the car, and we look forward to seeing it all done. It's our hope here to have the car completely finished and in brand new coat of red paint by the end of March. So continue to check back with us. We probably have one or two more video updates as we get the paint on the car, and then we start putting it all back together. We got side exhaust going on it and all those chrome bumpers that we had redone earlier in the video series. Looking forward to having this car come together and uh, actually drive it around in some parades um, this summer. So thanks for watching. Look forward to checking back with you soon. Take care and have a great week. Bye-bye.